Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Trophinet, the babbling Belgian, and welcome back to Horizon Zero Dawn in the Frozen Wilds expansion, although we're not over there beyond those hills. We're back in, uh, well, the areas of the main game. But uh, today I wanted to start out with getting the last part I need, the last part I needed for uh, the upgrades of the elemental weapons from the Frozen Wilds. So the last part I need is a Stormbird, and Varga herself is gonna help me out with that. You know I kind of missed all this red dust. Well, there's our Stormbird. When you're ready, I'll follow up and boom. So she's clearly gonna help us out. So uh, let's take our upgraded weapons. I don't think this is gonna take much longer. Because uh, we're doing quite a bit of damage. That'll help. There we go. Oh. Chat. So since we're doing a lot more damage, this, does, this won't take long, because there goes the, the sack. Let's put a few arrows on there, she's going to nosedive. That was not on top of me. My spear has been upgraded, so a critical hit might do a lot of damage here. Oh, I can override it. It's probably even better. Although I do want to have the parts of it, of course, but yeah, that's not overrided. Ow. Oh, that's gonna be a nosedive. There we go, machine down. So let's talk to her. I don't know where she ran off to because I didn't see her a lot during this fight. Hi, Varga. Found the part. Ready to fix up that weapon? I am always ready to fix up a weapon. So let's improve the ice reel first. I never thought I'd be glad to see the inside of a Thunderjaw's mouth. I sure am. Every machine's a big box of tools. Once they stop trying to kill you, that is. Trust me, Aloy. You won't recognize this ice rail when I'm through. Okay. There. Oh, she's perfect. A spear's a spear, right? Poke slash done. Boring. I adjusted the chill water flow, rebalanced here, strapped on a launcher, and now she shoots freezing spikes. Ta-da! <laughs> Whoa, okay, they more look different. More powerful. That's my guarantee. Nice. Let's go for the storm slinger next. One stormbird talent. Let's do it. I haven't had this much fun in ages. Yeah, this looks Want a lot to of learn, fun. Aloy? Only don't stare directly at the sparks. Okay. <sighs> okay, so I pretty much had to break her in half. But what's a staff? A stick. One thing I like about sticks. You can put them back together however you want. Which you did. This thing looks a whole lot more dangerous. She's better than dangerous. She's a genuine Varja special now. Take good care of her. And the soldiers in the background just started murdering a boar. So let's improve the forge fire. I got what you asked for. Show me what you had in mind for the forge fire. Finally. Was feeling like I neglected her. And that's a little too close to my family life. Okay. She's done and she's yours. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. That looks great. I almost expected you to turn it into a burning rope caster or something. Nah, she was close to perfect from the start. She's a Varja original, after all. Thanks, Varja. These three weapons are fine work. Are you kidding? I can't remember when I had this much fun. I should be thanking you. I'm the one walking away with the weapons, aren't I? It seems wrong to charge you for giving me an opportunity to do what I love doing. Don't tell Pop I said that. Yeah, he wouldn't appreciate that. Here, whenever I tinker with weapons, I go through fistfuls of this stuff. Maybe you'll get some use out of it. 
Blue Gleam? Ooh, obtained one Blue Gleam and an extraordinary reward box. So that is nice. So geared up, Storm Slinger and Forge Fire and Ice Rail completed. Which is nice, because I think I'm actually going to equip the Ice Rail, because those uh, Ice Spikes sound awesome. We're also going to go for another trophy right now. Oh, there we go. Fully improved weapons. <laughs> that was actually perfect timing. I didn't know that was a trophy as well. But... I have four skill points left, which means I can buy the last skill I needed. This mount strike, press square to launch a jumping attack from your mount. Damages medium machines and can take down small machines and humans. So let's learn that skill. And that's going to give us another trophy. All frozen wild skills learned. And there we go. So there we go, the upgraded ice rail. Look at this beauty. It looks like I can use it as a cannon as well, but there's very limited ammo for that. So I only have six shots with the ice cannon, which I actually want to try on the first thing I come across here. So I see a long leg over there. I don't know if I actually need to charge up this thing. So let's just... Oh wow, holy shit! This is awesome. Boom! Wow, okay. So there's one of those things that actually survived that, but it just the, the area, the splash damage of that thing, that was awesome. Uh, I think I found my new favorite weapon. Shit, there's a lot of stuff here now. Um, next up, we're gonna do another side quest, because of course I'm not gonna end the episode here. And maybe it's gonna be a side quest where we'll, uh, be using this weapon, because this thing is awesome now. See you guys in a second. So, a while back, a few episodes back, we talked to an old hunter called Umnak, and he was talking about something called the Claws Beneath. And I'm wondering if we can actually find this beast. Okay. So there's two things here. There's a rock breaker and there's a, yeah, a corruption tower. So I'm gonna have to be careful here. If I can just stay calm right now, should be able to take out the corruption tower before we fight the, uh, the thing over there, the, the claws. Just gonna call, Jesus. Don't think it saw me already. Shield won't hold up against those pulses. Oh come on, just move, move, away, Aloy. I could just fire away from over here. I'm just gonna craft a few arrows. Let it take out the shields and then. That even missed. It's pretty close. But I want to take out... Yeah, it's right over there because I can see the blue light coming from it. Oh, you shit! That scared the bejesus out of me. Shit. There goes the tower. Now this thing. Oh, there we go. Crap. Yeah, okay. This is not gonna work with this thing. It takes too long to charge. Oh shit, I can't roll out of the way. That 
think if I recall correctly, these things really don't like frost. Yeah, there we go. I think I hit it, kind of. I want to also get my... Uh, damn it. My potions here. Holy shit. If it's close again, I'm going to use the ice rail again. Yeah, freeze, buddy. Just quick firing a few arrows here, because... Oh, wow. No! Ow. Let's make a few more ice thrower packs. Yeah, there we go. Got the component off there. Come on. There we go. Whew. Oh wow. What the fuck? Uh, that takes care of the claws beneath. I love this ice rail. Holy shit. Let's just craft a few more of those things. This thing doesn't look good. It's kind of crushed in between the the floor and the... Mm. That's, that's sad. Uh, I'm just gonna gear up again. Get me a few healing items, and then we'll uh, return back to Umnak, and I'll see you guys in a second. So, we're back at the little encampment at the foot of uh, Thunder's Drum. So, uh, let's talk to Umnak and tell him the good news. It wasn't easy, but that rockbreaker won't be hurting anyone anymore. The claws beneath brought low by an outlander. <laughs> this part of your song will travel far. I don't know if I'll ever get used to that. I've found people rarely live up to their songs. You're an exception, though. And you've done me a true kindness. Well, you're welcome, Umnak. My foe is buried now, like so many of the hunters it killed. My friend, my chieftain. He would be pleased to know his fate won't befall anyone else. Take this in thanks. I believe you've more than earned it. Well, thank you. An extraordinary reward box and another bit of blue gleam. I think I can actually buy something now. Which, uh, well, I need to pass by Song's Edge anyway. Although there's a blue gleam traded over here. Let's see what he has. Or she has. So we have everything over here. Um, I don't have the champion bow yet. And I don't have the power shot bow yet. And I did buy all, I have all of that, so I don't think it's necessary. So I think I'm going to go for the Power Shield Bow. I know there's a few outfits you can buy with Blue Gleam as well. So the Banuk Ice Hunter Master, 
Karja Blazon Master, Nora Silent Hunter Master, and the Banuk Warak Chieftain outfit. I think we have that already. But I'm more interested in the weapons because I'm not going to change out from the Shield Weaver armor anyway. So, uh, Banuk Power Shot Bow it is. Let's buy it. Thank you. And let's equip it because I am going to. Yeah, I'm gonna go with, in, instead of the sharp shell bow, the power shell bow is gonna be a lot better. Uh, I'm gonna do a bit of inventory management as well, so give me a second. So I double checked and indeed the Banuk uh, versions of the weapons all have the ability to keep the bowstring drawn even longer to have this effect and do more damage. So this shot should do a lot more damage than a normal power shot, which is a... Uh, very cool indeed. So uh, with that upgrade done completely, because my power shield now has three uh, three upgrades as well, three modifications added to it as well. I'm gonna take a little break. So thank you guys enormously for watching. We're completely geared up now to do the rest of the end game stuff that's in the DLC. So uh, look forward to that, and we'll do more side quests as well. So thank you guys enormously for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, don't forget to like it right here on YouTube. And uh, I guess I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.